Today's checklist, stout boots. Yep, got them. Quite new, better take them off the table. Took them off the table, don't want a dragon to visit the house. Practical pantaloons, practical pantaloons. Clean socks and undies, yep, got those. A torch, torch, yeah, got the torch. Drone, got the drone. Phone, got my phone. And a pound coin in case I get lost. Yep, got that. Hello, my name is Martin. Welcome back to another video. So today is a video with a difference. We're going to go out and do a bit of a blog, vlog, vlog, blog, trog, log, whatever it is anyway. So we're going to go out and get some footage. We're going to go make a video. In fact, I'm filming today for three videos. In fact, I'm... <laughs> In fact, I'm filming today for three videos, so it's going to be quite a productive day for me. Not all my days are like this, a lot of my days are more about pontificating. Anyway, so, we're going to go to Manchester and we're going on a guided tour. I'll tell you where we're going in a minute, but I'm going to show you a snapshot of the guided tour. Then we're going to try and get some drone footage, and then we're going to go to another part of Manchester and get some more drone footage. And you'll just be able to see me flying the drone and getting really nervous and biting my nails and almost having a cardiac arrest because I get that nervous when the drone goes up in the air. It's like, oh my god, I'm still paying for it on my credit card. So, the first place we're going to go to is Mayfield Station, and I'm going on a guided tour around Mayfield. Now, I'm going to make it, I'm going to film inside it. And release that as a separate video but I will give you a taster in this video of, of what it's what it's like in there but only a quick snapshot thing is with it being a tour there's other people on the tour and I can't walk around Mayfield sort of like talking to the camera so I'll have to get footage try and remember what the tour guide says and then maybe voice over or something like that I'm then going to go outside and try and get some cheeky footage of of, with the drone of, May, of above Mayfield and round Piccadilly. It'll all be safe flying and everything, so don't worry about that. Then, like I say, we'll fly over to the other side of town, you'll see where I am in a bit, and we'll try and get some footage for another video I'm making, um, and we'll see how good a footage we can get with the drone. So, off we go into town. So Mayfield is just behind me there, but apparently we have to walk down here and walk to a pub and meet the tour guide. So let's go. Uh, I think it's that way. So we're here just by the Bull's Head pub waiting for the tour to start. And guess what? There's nobody else here. I hope it works out okay. Our little tour is over now. We're just outside Mayfield Station, and look where we are. We're just down by the Medlock. Do you remember when I said in, in the the last Medlock video that it's so inaccessible and so difficult to get to? Well, that just explains it there. But anyway, that's another video. So let's crack on. Yeah. Right. So this is the bit now. I'm going to try and get a little bit of drone footage. We're at the arse end of Mayfield Station. I've been here before in another video, so. It's always very nerve-wracking because you're kind of in public and it's kind of like a built-up area. But don't worry, I won't be flying the drone anywhere stupid. If it drops out of the sky, it'll either drop in the deserted area of Mayfield Station or on my head. So, what I'm going to try and do is, if you go and point it, I'm just trying to go up and just show. We'll just go, we'll just do a straight up and a straight down for the video, for the, uh, the Mayfield video. So, here we go. So, we're ready to go. I use this where the bit where I usually forget to press record. <laughs> yes, and we're ready to go. So I'll take off now. Off we go. So just okay. So press record. We'll just do a straight up, straight down. There's a wire there. We need to go. 
Oh, it's tricky. It's tricky, 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 tricky. Just a little bit more forward. This way. You'll notice, by the way, I am sh I am shit at flying drones. Right, so if you, you've seen where I am, I'm right up there now. So gonna, I've got a good pan there. If you, I don't know if you can see on there. That's what the drone is seeing. And we're just going to pan around a little bit. Daddy. So it's always a relief when it comes back down. So what we did was just go up there, safe shots really, no no major flying over any, if, like I say, if it fell out of the sky, and drones tend not to fall out of the sky, it just would have fell into Mayfield Station, or it would have just basically fell on me. But it's always a relief, I get so nervous when I'm flying the drone to try and get footage, but the footage you get, it's so nerve wracking to get it, but the footage you get is so amazing. And I can show you now an aerial view for uh, Mayfield Station when I do that video. So there you go. So what we're here in this really massively cavernous part of Manchester, surrounded by railway viaducts and the river M Medlock goes underneath us. I'm just showing Andrew, my friend, where the, what I call the cathedral is. And it's in another video I did called Disused Stations, Railway Arches and Rain. And this cathedral is like, the medlock is under an arch and also down in a culvert and the medlock is right at the bottom of this vast space, look at that. It is vast. And the medlock's right over there if you see, just underneath there. Quite a fascinating part of town but this whole area I did in another video called, like I say, called Disused Stations, Railway Arches and Rain. So we're going to move on to the second location now. We're going to have a coffee, I think, because we're cold. I need a wee. I need a hot drink. But um, like I say, doing three videos in one today. So we're doing this video, the making of. We've been in Mayfield Station, got some good footage in there. I'll have to do a lot of voiceover on that. And then we're going to go to the third location. And that's the next <laughs> surprise. <laughs> but you can't wait, can you? And that cold my face has gone all red. Right, second location. This is a bit more tricky. We're going to fly the drone again. Very, very tricky. I'll show you why in a minute. But second location for another video I'm doing. Let's go. So we're just down by the Salford Junction Canal. Look at that. Murky. And that canal used to go that way through the wall there. As you can see. So it's been bricked up, but we're going over there to that bridge there. Right, so we're down by the Irwell, so I'm trying to try and get some shots now. You see out there behind me is the Oddsall Cord. So there's something beyond the Oddsall Cord that I want to try and get a shot of, and it's very difficult to see. Um, I'm not going to say what it is because I'll spoil the video, but tricky place to fly. Well, not too bad. We're going to fly along the Irwell here. I'm going to fly down there towards those bridges now interesting see the white bridge there I wouldn't have to do any of this if that little white bridge there was open but unfortunately I've got to do what I've got to do and see what we can get always remember to press record 
need to watch that thing above me there. And that way out over the bedrock. Over the bedrock. Very well. Just a bit higher. Out. Find the lamp post. So what I'm going to go for is I'm going to go for a shot flying along the Irwell there. Do you know what? For a second then I completely couldn't see the drone. And I'm going to go up. Right, so the tricky bit now, I'm going to try and fly under the bridge or towards the bridge and get a shot of the other side of the bridge and it's going to be hard. I may lose the drone here, I don't want to. See how shitty I'm at flying it. so nerve-wracking right <laughs> the thing is when it gets under the bridge I got what I got the footage I wanted I'm just thinking please don't lose signal because of the great big steel bridge and everything please don't lose signal please don't drop into the air well and then it's like bringing it back and uh, knowing me the way I am with this press the wrong button and I'll start sending it up into the bridge or something stupid like that anyway fortunately we got the footage right now we deserve a coffee. <laughs> right, that was very, very nerve wracking. Yeah. And the thing is, if you lose the drone, <laughs> there's two things that have pissed me off. And believe it or not, the last thing that pisses me off is the fact that I've lost the drone. Thing number one is that, that if the drone goes somewhere and you can see it and you can't get to it, and somebody else can get it, bloody hell. Thing number two is the card, the SD card is on the drone. So all that footage you've got, bang goes in the air well in fact i could probably live with it if it went in the air well because nobody else can get me drone then i just want the footage back but i suppose even though they're quite expensive the risk is that at some point well no i can't say it but the risk is <laughs> you could lose it although that mavic the mavic pro that i've got there is really really rock steady in the air anyway i'm buzzing now because i've got my footage productive day that that said like i say now i'm going to go and get a coffee so a bit of a haunt of mine recently is this new place on Berry New Road, Tim Hortons. It's some Canadian coffee place where you can get cakes and coffee. The coffee's mm, hit and miss, but we'll see what it's like today. So there we go. Potato wedges. Ham sandwich with a coffee. I reckon I quite deserve that to be honest with you after such a nerve-wracking day flying the drone about everywhere and there you go we're back home back in the echo chamber that is my back bedroom i hope you enjoyed this little video uh, just a bit of an insight for you into flying the drone and getting the various shots and stuff that we do sorry about the only the bits of snapshots of mayfield station but i will put together a full video about that so you will get to see inside so the next videos are the mayfield video and then let's just say the one after that We'll have a bit of a railway theme to it. Should be quite interesting, hopefully. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you rely on Facebook to see my videos, or you look at them, you see them through Facebook, consider coming over to YouTube. Make yourself a little account. It's just, it's all free and everything. It's just like setting up an account. You can use a fake name. You don't have to put all your personal details in but it'll allow you to subscribe to my channel and then you'll be able to follow me on YouTube. And the bigger we grow the YouTube channel, the more opportunities we might get to do things. But just something for you to consider if you do that for me. Follow me and subscribe to me on YouTube. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. A bit light-hearted today. Take care and I shall see you very soon in the next video, which might be the Mayfield one. Not sure. See you soon.